First question. There's going to be eight questions this week. Last week we had six. This week we have eight. What boxer made his first title defense in 21 years in 1995? Go. What boxer made his first title defense in 21 years in the year 1995? See, nothing yet. I heard it's a big dude. We got nothing yet in the chat. There we go. Who got it first? Andre got it. Is that right? No, we got Nando Yamas again. He came in with Man, yo, Nando Whoa. came out like with he a right Funky hand. Like, I, I, Andre, I, 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 he BG Funky. Whoa, Nando yo, yo, Yamas. Nando came out like, like, like with something to prove, bro. What's going on now? You know what I mean? One for Nando. Nando Yamas. You, you're writing it down, Kellex? I got it one. Nando. All right, cool, cool, cool. cool. I'll just focus on the music that way. All right. All right. Question number two. Here we go. Get ready. Y'all got to get, get ready, ready. Get your Google fingers ready. Let me get the chat ready. Get your Google right. and your brain. Remember, if you know, you know, right? So, <laughs> Which heavyweight fighter successfully defended his title against both George Foreman and Larry Holmes? Go. Heavyweight fighter defended his title successfully against George Foreman and Larry Holmes. Heavyweight, 90s. See what we got? No, no. There we got, we got, we got one, we got one. That's right. That's Andre got it first, right? Andre Rodriguez got it first. Evander Holyfield. Yo, yo, let me tell you something, by the man. Way, he would lose his next fight to Riddick Bow. So we got uh, one. Let me just tell you guys Andre. something right now, bro. Like Andre's like, you know, you know, Nando, you ain't winning shit this time, bro. You know what I mean? <laughs> Andre's he landed a hook. He almost got that first one too. He came with that hook, bro. He landed a devastating hook. You know what I mean? He's breaking people's will. Three people left the the, the chat. Like he's breaking their will already, bro. Look at this. Let's go. <laughs> <Santeo> said butterbean. <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Question number three. Whammy, whammy. Question number three. All right. Let me make sure I get this right. What forced Sugar Ray Robinson, we're going back, what forced Sugar Ray Robinson to retire on his stool in his fight against Joey Maxim in 1952? What forced him to retire? Come on, guys. In the corner. I'm a Robinson guy, so. I believe this is before the 14th round or after the 14th round. Retired on his stool. Why did he retire on his stool? Y'all just throwing shit out there. There we go. Chief Funky got it. Did he? Oh, you before me. Oh. Heat exhaustion. That's right. He is G Funky in the building. G Funky got one. Look, we got ourselves a battle here. Light heavyweight he championship. Show. He was winning the fight. I think like two refs passed out or some crazy shit like that. You yeah, outdoors, I, mean? and- I believe. It was outdoors, and, uh, you know, it was what it was. So Robinson was never knocked out. It's on the record books as a knockout, but he wasn't knocked out. You know what I mean? That, that's I what it think was. We're gonna, I, I don't think we can accept cramps, all right? I think we got to go with heat. I think we got to go with heat, right, over heat cramps. I don't I, think we can I, accept cramps as, as, he, a, as the answer. Heat, exa- heat cramps. Come on, man. <laughs> heat exhaustion, brother. That, that, that was that's heat. what it was. Heat exhaustion. So look, man, we got ourselves a battle here. Everybody's still alive. Five more questions. One, one, one. All right, here we go. Everybody should know this one. Which British boxer, British boxer, came to public attention when he won the silver medal, British boxer, silver medal, in the lightweight division at the 2004 Olympics? British boxer, silver medal, lightweight division, 2004. Oh boy. Easy work. Come on, guys. Nothing yet. Who got it? I see it there. Big Big Dog Willie. Yo, American Big Dog Willie comes out. Man, yo, yo, oh. Nando, it ain't, it ain't going to get handed to you this time, brother. Like, this time, you got some real competition now. You know what I mean? Big Dog Willie's got one. Dude, we got a four way tie halfway through this thing. People came out with a mirror. But uh, we need to really establish a rule it. right now. Um, somebody said a mirror, which is fine. Are we going to accept first names or they got to say the last name? 
I think we'll accept first names as long as I know what they're talking about. Well, there's a lot of first like John. You know what I mean? Or like, you know, like. Let's use it on a common sense basis, maybe. Okay. All right. That That sounds good. That might get muddy. We'll see. We'll see. We'll play it out. Question number five. Question number five. In 2006, 2006, these these next two are Miguel Cotto questions. Miguel Cotto fan, it's my show. Miguel Cotto trivia, the next two. Easy work. 2006, Miguel Cotto fought at 140 for the final time. 2006, fought at 140 for the final time. Successfully defending his WBO title, name his opponent. His last fight at 140, name his opponent. Successfully defended his title. Who was his opponent? Last fight at 140. Y'all don't have time to pull up box rec. <laughs> Somebody got it. Who is that? Let's see who got it first. Rundle? That's Run PMC. That's Run PMC. Okay. He beat G Funky to the. To, is that right? Yeah. He was the first one. He beat G, G Funky to the punch. It, it was Polly. Was in Torres. No, it was Polly. Oh, wow. Torres came before Polly. All right. Okay. So now we got, is that two for, no, it's one for run PMC. Dude, we got a five-way tie. Got a five-way tie, ladies and gentlemen. We got a five-way tie. Everybody's no, still the, the, alive. Three more questions. Everyone is, is, is still is, alive. Is Boston Republic still out there? Did she give up? Was her will broken? Or what? like, what's going on there? <laughs> Shout out Boston Republic, by the way. Shout I was, out was pumping up the Willie. women, and they're, they're not getting any points, brother. Like, what's going on over here? Shout All out right. Boxing Republic and Big Dog Willie for the support, by the way. Um, and Big Dog Willie is still alive. Boxing Republic still alive, too. Look, man, we got a five-way tie here. Three questions left. Another Miguel Cotto, Cotto question. In 2012, Miguel Cotto went 0-2. You should know this. Name the two fighters who defeated him. Go. Oh, and two, 2012. Name is two losses. We got it yet or no? Yeah, who got it first? Run PMC? Did he get it? Yep. Run PMC first. Floyd and Trout. Whoa. Barely beating the GOAT. Barely beating G Funk. Yeah, Pacquiao Girl. was in 09, guys, or 010, right? So what we got? Run PMC is two. Run PMC, dude. He's in the driver's seat. We still got two. Wow. What's we going on, Nando? Two questions left. Two hey, questions Nando, left. Your title's going to get snatched, bro. What happened? Everyone is still officially alive. All right? We go to a tie. We'll figure out another question. Right, D-Style? And for those with zero, this is your shot right here. You need two straight. You know what I mean? The same. That's right. So we got ourselves a tie. And by the way, D-Style... I didn't come up with an extra question, so come up with an extra question. <laughs> That's fine. If we, go, if we go overtime. All right. Question number seven. In which country did Muhammad Ali's final fight take place? Which country? Final fight. He lost to Trevor Burbick in this fight and then retired at 56 and 5. What country did it take place? Muhammad Ali. Last fight. Which country? Is that right? Is that run PMC again? He got it. Yeah, that's it. I think that's he it. He got won. The Bahamas. He's got three run points, PMC. right? I think he officially just wrapped it up. He officially wrapped it up. Let's let, let's 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 still run this last question. He, he knocked everybody out of the eleventh round, brother. <laughs> that's it. That's right. It was against Trevor Burbick. I think he um he lost that last fight. It was in the Bahamas. Man. He retired. He was like, I don't want to, like, he, he did what Whitaker said. You know what I mean? The best defense is knock them all out. Like, you know, now, like, let's go, you know? <laughs> that was a knockout. Run PMC, man. Shout out to Run PMC. A new champion. Be rabbit. Be rat. No, we got Run PMC. New champion. Dude, last question. We're still going to ask it. On April 6, 1983, in my hometown, New Orleans, Louisiana, Andy Bowen and Jack Burke fought in what is considered the longest boxing match ever recorded. The bout lasted seven hours and 19 minutes. The match was to be fought until there was a KO. This fight ended in a draw where both participants refused to come out of their corners. How many rounds did this fight go? 
Go. Seven this hours. Five points, season. guys. The winner of this one, they, they win the whole thing. That's funny. <laughs> It's like the money ball in the All Star game. <laughs> We're like our family feud. One family's getting beat the whole game, but they, they win the last row. So you know what I mean. <laughs> this is not correct, but close. This is not correct, but close. Man, y'all just throwing rounds out there, bro. Like, I feel, I have a feeling that nobody's gonna get this. Boxer girl had had to hit us with the sixty nine. To be honest with you, I don't even, I don't know the answer to that question. I know I knew all the other ones. I don't know this one. I'm gonna give y'all 20 more seconds. See if somebody can hit it. 86. It wasn't 87. 107. The goats warmer, warmer. I'm gonna hit y'all with the prices right. Warmer. 101. 107. Keep going. Keep going. You getting close, goat? 112. Nope. Still close. Somewhere 115. between 112. So 111. No. 110. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Andre got it. I'm gonna give that to Andre Rodriguez. He got it. All 110. Right. Andre. So he's punching. He's still. He went out swinging, brother. You know what I mean? So look, man. Shout out to Run PMC as a champion. More on that in a minute. Andre Rodriguez came in second with two. Nando got on the board. G Funky got on the board. Big Dog Willie got on the board. And look, D-Style, we got ourselves a new.